I'm here at Swisher Acquisition today to introduce our new uh, Commercial Pro Truck Spreader uh, with lots of enhanced features. But before I get started and start talking about the features, I'm going to go ahead and show you how easy it is for me to mount this up to my truck. We'll start with the, the toolless receiver mount. Slide it into my desired position. Then, all I simply have to do is I can tip this part of the spreader over. I can remove this pin. I'll tip this down and I'll slide this pin through this hole to hold that in position. Slide it to my desired height setting. And I simply tip the spreader up into position. Reinstall the hitch pin. I've already pre-wired my truck in advance of this, so I can go ahead and connect these uh, electrical connections up. Before we go any further, let me describe some of the, the features of this new spreader. Um, it comes with uh, zinc nickel plated components for enhanced corrosion protection. It has adjustable fins, a 25 gallon, 300 pound media hopper that is completely corrosion resistant, uh, an 8 inch easy fill spin on unfilled lid, and it does have an agitator inside to promote media flow. Okay, so now you know we've got the spreader mounted to our vehicle. Here, before I get finished, I'll put the uh, the straps on to add the additional support. But I really want to show you this uh, programmable controller that allows the operator to control the spreader from the cab of the truck. Um, you know, our previous model had a manual gate uh, open and unclose. Uh, a lot of enhancements on this to change. You can program the gate so it'll position to two opening positions to close, and also control your spinner from here. So let's go ahead and plug this in and uh, get going. So I plug this in and as you can see I can turn, off, turn on and off the third horsepower gear driven gearbox motor for the spinner control which also controls the agitator inside the spreader. This one is already pre-programmed for me so if I hit the one button it will open the gate to the full position. I can push three it will completely close the gate or section two is programmed to go to uh, half open. And at any time I can press the two keys, let off, and if I want to change it to that position, I can press and hold the one button after that. But uh, for this, we're gonna go ahead and close the gate to get started. Okay. I think we're ready to go. I'll uh, put some uh, ice melt in the, the spreader. I'll hook up the controller and uh, we'll get to spreading. Okay, Let's get some uh, ice melt poured in here and we'll get to spreading. It has a uh, eight inch easy fill hopper hole. Really makes getting the media in there a lot easier. Let's get spreading. All right, we've got our uh, our ice melt in the back. We're going to uh, save some slip in here. I'm going to open my gate. I'm going to use the uh, number two gate position for now. Turn my uh, agitator on, and we're spreading.
Okay, there you have it. We are here at Swisher in Warrensburg, Missouri today showing the new Swisher Commercial Pro truck spreader with many new features uh, over the prior version. Again, a 25 gallon, 300 pound media hopper with an eight inch easy opening lid, zinc nickel plated components for enhanced uh, corrosion protection, uh, the remote control so you can operate it from the cab of the truck, no need to get out in the weather, just open and close your gate. Two programmable open positions and, a pro and then to close it as well. Uh, for more information on this, uh, check it out. Thanks.